It is November 24th. I'm Mark Stewart Greenstein, candidate for governor of Connecticut, and I want to mostly speak with Republicans or those who are in favor of a large tax cut, as Trump currently is. Folks, it can't be at the expense of younger generations, and that is a hallmark of tax cutting ever since the Reagan administration where there were planned deficits. That is not responsible. You should stand up to this. That's irresponsible government. Have tax cuts if there are spending cuts. I'm all in favor of that. But if you see, as Trump does, a $1.5 trillion deficit that is going to be made up by future taxes, or even worse, a higher than $1.5 trillion if you use real accounting, and you're relying on dynamic scoring, that you're trying to have expectations of future growth built in to lessening the deficit. That's chicanery. Use best estimate numbers, and most importantly, don't burden younger people other than in a national emergency. What I call a national emergency, we haven't seen since World War II. Two-front war, we've never had that before. We needed that. There's been no federal project since. There's been no federal cause since that should require deficit spending, okay? If there's really 1.5 trillion dollars more that things don't cover night right now you tax households within a year okay you do not let this go for 5 10 15 25 years you could do this all right it's ten thousand dollars per household now if that sounds like ooh, too much to swallow maybe you are trying to swallow too much Maybe, let's get it now, maybe this is unwarranted spending. Cut the spending, and you don't need tax increases now or later. Folks, I'm a candidate for governor, and here's how I would apply this. There will be no deficit spending that is not made up within one year in the state of Connecticut while I sit in the governor's seat. If you, the legislature, want to raise spending, you have automatically raised taxes. Okay? If that's a fair way to do it, fine, but you're going to get voted on because that vote will come up within a year as well. So I implore responsible spending in the first place. But if you're going to be irresponsible, and that unfortunately is the legislature's priority, I've got veto power, but it could be overridden. Well, you will have to make it up. There will be no deficit spending short of a national emergency on this governor's watch. Republicans, you're supposed to be the party of fiscal responsibility. Start here in 2017 nationally by objecting to any tax plan that has built-in deficits. Thank you.